Okay, so you dressed up for the occasion, the kilt's on, you have the Lifetime Achievement Award. How is this night for you? Humbling, humbling and exciting and, and very grateful, very grateful. Yeah, I mean, you've won BAFTAs, Oscars, you've won a lot of awards, but it's sometimes nice when you're honored by your peers, huh? It's more important to be honored by your peers. Uh, they're the ones that have the critical ear, basically, in this business that recognize not just so much the sound, but basically also the contributions that you've made in helping others get, get, get on in this, in this business. A lot of uh, sound mixers basically will find a great boom operator and they don't want to let them go because they know that the good boom operator makes them, feel, makes them really sound good. My feeling was that when... Um, I had a great boom operator, I would let him mix a little bit. I always wanted to have a crew that basically, if, if somebody got sick and couldn't do the job or had to leave, that, that there was a backup there. So my guys were always, you know, like preparing to be sound mixers and I was so happy that I was able to move five people along to become, you know, very successful sound mixers on their own right. That was probably more more precious to me than practically any award. Now this is very, very precious because this is from my peers. Uh, and I'm extremely happy and, you know, and, and uh, uh, proud, which is kind of an odd word because it's, it's, a, it's a sin, I think, in the uh, Christian religion, which I'm really not that much It's not a sin tonight. <laughs> tonight it's not a sin. I get away with it. I'm a Buddhist. <laughs> And obviously, you know, when you have a lifetime achievement, you really get to reflect upon your work. Any highlights for you personally? I'm sure a lot of people go, hey, and they have their favorites, but what are your favorites? Oh my God, like, you know, watching the uh, highlights that uh, I know Peter Devlin put together, I'm thinking, God, my God, did I do that? <laughs> <laughs> are you sure that was oh me? God, that was me. <laughs> you know, they, um, there's a continuum that basically... Uh, is a, it's like a series of waves, you know. I mean, you have these moments that are just fabulous, and you have these times when things are really kind of, it's dread. And, and films are like that, and life's like that. You know, you basically go through these waves, and you have to, you have to sort of appreciate that sometimes, like, you know, when you are after an 18-hour day, you're really fed up, and you, you want to go home and get in your own bed. Uh, and then there's these moments when you have like a, you know you have a great inspiration and in how to basically conquer a, a, a sound problem on set and you think you're pretty damn smart and you're very very elated and uh, you go away feeling pretty good about yourself but it's um, that it's a series of ups and downs you know uh, but mostly on the you know when looking back it's like you know what a great what a great time I had 